Hi everybody, I'm Emily and this is Anita. Hi. Anita is our bereavement services officer, so we're out and about today just to catch up with her a little bit and see what her job entails. So Anita, can you tell me a little bit about what your job entails? Well, I'm bereavement services officer. We're a small team, so basically I look after the cemeteries. Everything to do with grave searches, interments, headstones, the site, the buildings, and just general care, mm -hmm. making sure that we provide a dignified service to everybody that comes to. My office space is probably about 60%, mm -hmm. and then the rest of the time I am out at each of the cemeteries. We've got four mm -hmm. that we look after. So there's uh, two in Poulton, Moreland Road and Garstang Road East. We also have Preezal Cemetery in Overwire and Fleetwood Cemetery, which is the largest, that's 17 acre site. Well, as you can see, uh, it's a lovely day today. So we are having to wear our sunglasses a little bit, but it's kind of the perfect day to show you what our cemeteries look like. We'll visit a few of the sites and we'll show you a little bit more about what Anita and the team have to offer. So brilliant, we'll see you soon. This is Poulton New Cemetery. It, although it has been here since 1929, it was extended in 1990 and this is on Garstang Road East in Poulton. Yeah, we have grounds team that are based at the cemeteries so that gives us comfort in the fact that we know families have got people to speak to when they come. So they look after the whole area, all the grass cutting, strimming, they take care of the tree work, uh, we have a woodland section at Poulton now, so there's different types of work involved in there. Uh, we also have a woodland burial area. Uh, this involves uh, no headstone at all. So the burial takes place usually in a wicker or willow type coffin, natural materials. We can do them for two burials. And then a tree is planted afterwards, uh, which is like the last in the memorial area. And we do get a lot of wildlife in here, woodpeckers, girls, owls, all sorts of types of birds. Uh, so it's, it's quite a nice, lovely sort of natural setting. The cemetery itself won an award last year. So the Memorial Awareness Board, the competition that they ran, we won the uh, burial site for the year. So it was a lovely accolade to get. Now we're at Fleetwood Cemetery. This is the largest cemetery that we have. So it's 17 acres in here. We've got very hard working staff. They're constantly mowing, strimming, and they also do all the burials. This cemetery well. has been here since 1841. So in 2021, it's going to be 180 years old. Um, a lot of headstones, as you can imagine, we've got over 10,000 headstones in wire cemeteries, and we've got over 21,000 grave spaces. In here, we have the above ground wall niches which have become very popular. They were first installed in 2009 and um, we've just developed the second area now for these. The first area you can place ashes caskets in, up to four, so they're like a family unit. And like I say, families have really taken to these and it means that they've got somewhere local to come and visit. The, we're part of the Heritage Week, which is in September. So on Thursday the 19th of September at 10 o'clock we organise a history trail. So it's got about 20 markers within the graves, um, within the cemetery, 20 graves. And we just tell you a little bit about those they people. may have been involved in building buildings in Fleetwood, the fishermen, the boat builders. We're just having a, a, you know, a nice walk around, we get to find out lots of interesting facts. So. Yeah, welcome anybody to come along. We can just turn up at 10 o'clock and there's usually myself, my colleague Barbara. Um, so obviously we offer a lot of services you've heard us talk about today. Um, if you want to visit our website, um, there's a lot, a lots of information there, as um, Anita said, about um, grave searches, um, the, the services that we offer, information about our cemeteries here in Wire as well. Um, you can visit our website which is www.wire.gov.uk um, If you'd ever like to speak to one of the bereavement services uh, team you can obviously call us on uh, 01253 891000 and I'm sure Anita or someone else in the team would be more than happy to help you. And uh, for now we'll uh, speak to you soon, so thank you everybody.